NXT Championship from last time. I remember how I said uh, I wanted to have a, a television championship. Well, unfortunately, I cannot do that because um, I have no show, no more shows left to put it on. But if I did, I would so make a television championship. But for now, we have the NXT championship. And, um, it, like I said, Cody Rhodes, NXT champion versus CM Punk versus Rob Van Dam. I am expecting either CM Punk or Cody Rhodes to win because Rob Van Dam hasn't been doing so well lately. He has been, he lost to CM Punk about two weeks before the Rumble and then he lost to Cody Rhodes one week before the Rumble. Actually, one week, no, it was this Friday he lost to Cody Rhodes. And then the Friday before that, uh, Rob Van Dam lost to uh, CM Punk. But the way he's in this match was because the f first and second week, so four weeks before the f Rumble and th th three weeks before the Rumble, he was uh, actually doing pretty well. He... Uh, pinned the former NXT champion, um, Sin Cara, and then he helped, uh, Cody Rhodes, uh, when, actually, if I remember correctly, Rob Van Dam hit, uh, like, three weeks before the pay-per-view, if I remember right, uh, it was Cody Rhodes versus, um, and Rob Van Dam versus, I think it was Sin Cara and Hunako, and Rob Van Dam came up behind Cody Rhodes and closed line him and then left Cody Rhodes out there by himself to try to defeat. Unico and Sin Cara by himself, which Cody Rhodes did. So that's how Cody Rhodes is the champion. That uh, he's he's still the champion. He has been since the night right after bragging rights. So yeah. Originally, CM Punk was supposed to be on Raw, but he was not doing that well. He wasn't on any shows at all. But now, at, since I put him on NXT, he's been on basically every single show. Now, what I don't get on NXT is the big main event that's been going on for about four weeks now. It has been Zack Ryder versus Drew McIntyre. To me, that wouldn't even be a main event, even on NXT. But, whatever. Ga whatever the game says, I guess. But, right now, like I said, computers uh, continue to just decide to do a roll-up pin, and then try to pin each other for, like, like, a couple, uh, sometimes it even, it's like eight times sometimes before they finally just kick out or get pinned. It's really annoying. Ooh, double team on the NXT champion. I believe, yeah, Cody Rhodes 
pretty good NXT champion. He's held it for quite some time now. But the real question is, how much longer is he going to hold it for? He could lose it uh, tonight against CM Punk or Rob Van Dam. I don't think he is going to, though. I mean, maybe CM Punk. But definitely not Rob Van Dam. Rob Van Dam's just... Has been horrible. Lately, like, he hasn't done a very good job. He's... I think he has a bigger losing streak than a winning streak, but... Whatever. Ooh, CM Punk caught Cody Rhodes and GTS. He's going for the pin one. Just a one count. Wow. That's how... Uh... Fight, uh, how much fight there is still in Cody Rhodes. I love the crossroads. The crossroads is awesome. I love that finisher. I love the five star frog splash too. Even though Rob Van Dam probably won't ever hit that move. Even attempt to do it. But, whatever. Rob Van Dam's already hurt. It's funny. Because this match just barely started about almost seven minutes ago. And Rob Van Dam hasn't... Hey, he's been the main focus, but he shouldn't be hurt that much. No, I... He's obsessed with that chair. Rob Van Dam's like obsessed with that chair. <laughs> or he was. He didn't know if he was going to use it or not. And that was kind of funny. A glitch. <laughs> Ooh, roll up pin. One, two. And roll up pin again. One, two. Wait, is CM Punk out? I think CM Punk just got pinned. Wow. If he did, that would have been a... Just... Wow. <laughs> Apparently he did, because no one's going after him anymore. Dang. But I don't want CM Punk to lose yet. Watch Rob Van Dam become the champion. That'd be kind of stupid. Because how, because of how horrible he's been doing. And one, just a one count. Wow. No, nope. Wow. And I believe that's his signature. Going for the pin off that. Yeah. I thought that's what was going to happen. Just hit the five star frog splash. Wow, I thought that was a three count right there. Are you gonna tie up? Oh, are you gonna tie up? Nope. No one taps. Who taps? Absolutely no one taps on this game. Man, this has been a pretty long episode. It's been 10 minutes, but the 
don't really care. Come on, go for the five star frog splash. I think he's actually gonna try for it. Or he was. One, just one count. And crossroads. Pinning him. One, two, three. Rope break. Wow, that's a lucky break. <laughs> that was a horrible joke. Come on, Rob Van Dam. My God. It takes so long. This match has gone on for quite some time. Rob Van Dam has tried and tried and tried to hit that one move. The five star frog splash, but he's failed. A lot. One. Just a one count again. My god. There, Rob Van Dam's bleeding. Now all Cody Rhodes has to do is pin him. After someone's ble bloody, it's usually the end. Especially uh, created characters. Whoa, he kicked out way... Okay, never mind. Yeah, Rob, Cody Rhodes says, you're not gonna win this match, are you? And a one, and a two, and a three. Cody Rhodes still yo NXT champion. Look at that face. That's a really bloody face. Alright. Well, next match is the World Heavyweight Championship match between these competitors. Triple H versus Mark Henry, the world's strongest man versus the game. The king of kings versus the world's strongest man. This could be a what now match? <laughs> Unfortunately, after their... After they enter, I'm going to have to stop it because, uh, well, that first match, the NXT Championship match, well, used a whole bunch of time, and I only have, I don't know, a little bit more time before I can't do any more, so... I'm gonna have to skip their entrance. Mark Henry, the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. Or the world heavyweight championship. Yes, Mark Henry versus Triple H. There we go. Alright. See you guys next time we will be doing this match. Goodbye.